Hi. Welcome to my tube, my channel, White Butterfly, <laughs> or Moth, whichever. Passes through a couple times a day. I got a picture of it today earlier. That was cool. I got a couple cool pictures earlier. My name's Standing Turtle. <laughs> Standing Turtle. I'm Hailka, I'm Empath, and I just like having these little talks on the way I feel about things. And being Hailka, you always feel some kind of way. Unless I'm in a meditate state. Then I'm just tiling, do, dialing, dialed into source, tuned into source, and receiving energy. I'm not really thinking about anything. I got Benny down here. I'm giving him love. He came out for the talk today. Oh, being all, I just cleaned one of his ears. It's rough having long ears. It's like a Petri dish in there. Anyway, I meditated early today. I was going to do another one, another hour this afternoon, and then just ended up making a nice dinner for me and Ma and just kind of zoning out listening to people's different talks their, their different takes on things and then I put them together and and then I I, I I put my presentation out here as to how I think things are gonna go here in the next little while <laughs> I go by energy frequency heart space and there's this this e this this stripping of egos right now and People are finding their spirit, and it's really cool that they are. It's just going to be really scary and gross for a while. It's a lot of suicide. Another, another young, young monarch butterfly, young vibrant spirit took his own life. Thirty-one years old. Can't remember the interface. One of those T words, not Twitter, twatter. Another one. You know, people get too much too fast, and they don't know what to do with it. They short out, and people are going to short out. That's why I'm okay with slow and organic, and I don't mind not having a lot of friends and it, that they come in. You know what? I had two really cool offers today, though. Benny. Benny. I think it's a knot. Benny. Benny. Don't dig. Don't dig. Ugh, bugs on me. It's a no landing zone. I'm a low landing zone. That's the only rule, rule about bugs with me. I'll let you live, but if you get on me and I don't want you on you, on me, <laughs> I'll put you down off me. And if you get back on me, then I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Cause it's you know it's that imposing will. It's that vibrational. Of, I'm just going to be on you. I don't care if you want it or not. So, how are you doing in the in the in the cosmoses? Um, the world largest game of cooties. <laughs> That's what I see all this. Everybody has cooties. Ew, you have cooties. Ew, you have cooties. My grandpa had polio when he was young. Benny. Benny, come on. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. This is why I don't like to hang out with you while I do these little lives out in outside because it's too disruptive and then I'm trying not to get mad. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, but he has his own free will too. Anyway, all right. So yeah, my grandpa had polio he, um, when he was young. He was born in, I don't know what year he was born in. Grandma was born in 1919, the same year that that uh, MC the that that Einstein came up with relativity. Is what one story is. So. One storyline I thought about today is, I wonder if, like, people that, like, because he had polio, maybe because he had polio, maybe my family line is like, okay, if you get polio now, <laughs> then everybody after you <laughs> will be okay in some areas, you know, as long as they maintain their healthy, their, their health, you know, as long as they don't live too much in their ego. And then you have people that are, that, were born into my grandfather's, you know, that indulged in alcohol and all this ego stuff, and it just freaking ruined them. Then you have those examples that went and moved more into their heart, and <clears throat> and uh, things turned out okay for them. 
you know, living from their spirit. And the whole world is figuring out heart and spirit right now. I'm putting them inside. Come on, go, go, on the light, come on, come on, come on, come on, go, 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 on the light, come on, go, go, good dog, good dog, good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, come on, go, yeah, 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 It's not him, it's me. He just wants to be a dog and dig hole and eat dirt and stuff like that. And I'm, I don't want that right now. So I own it. So when I'm done with my talk, I'll let him come out and give him the, let him be how he wants to be. <laughs> Without me going, ah, <laughs> inside. So I was thinking a lot of today about um, Raiders of the Lost Ark. And that's kind of what I feel like this whole eclipse energy is that's coming up on the 4th or 5th or 6th, depending on who's telling the story and what part of the world they're living in. <laughs> it's like people think that there's one Earth. I'm like, how can there be one Earth, man? There's freaking a gazillion people on the planet, and they're all experience having different experiences, you know, just based on the color of the shade of their skin alone. So, one earth, that's funny. <laughs> um, so I went down the ant hole of uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark, and I recommend people go, you know, check out the movie, you know, and it's it's about the Ark of the Covenant, and I don't know a whole lot about the, the, the background, that hit sort of history in that part of the country. You know, I've been part of made-up conflicts to go over there, so people can take their stuff and use it for, you know, their own opportunities and things like that and and say that and tell the rest of the world that that that, that they're doing us a favor cuz it, it's all related to security somehow and it's just <laughs> stupid and lame. <laughs> so uh, um you know, there's a lot of stuff that I I, I ain't never read the Bible front to back, but I I know some about it and I've spent a lot of time around people that have deciphered it and put their own interpretations on it and things like that and uh and there is there's dark magic and light magic it's just it's always existed you know and i look at shadow magic dark magic black magic whatever you want to call it sadism it's the easier softer way it's the cheater's way and then you have the light spirits the light the 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 white warrior the you know the heoka the the fateful, and they are the ones that, you know, go the slow organic way and don't cheat by freaking taking the blood and, and body parts of other things and using them to your advantage like creepy creeper tins and all that stuff, you know, whatever the storyline is. Yeah, there's a storyline exists for everyone, you know. I remember seeing my first snuff film when I was like 14 years old. So, no, I mean, anyone that's ever seen Faces of Death, that's a, you know, it's a snuff film. It's you know, and, and th I, that was, that's not even the snuff films that I'm, I'm talking about. So I know what happens to people when people get taken. I've always known, you know, and then, and then it doesn't happen in everybody's neighborhood. And then now, now it's happening in everybody's neighborhood. You know, people are, are realizing, oh my God, there's, there's wicked people in the world that like to intentionally hurt people and that might even like to eat people and do things like that. Well, yeah, there are. And for people to deny it. That's like denying shadow starts of yourself. And those are the parts that are coming out. See, I feel the way I look at this eclipse energy that's coming up on Monday. You know, and where it is is not charging stones. You don't charge your stones in this kind of energy. Because this is karmic. It's all karmic. It's like, if you've been living in your ego, your, your world's about to get freaking rocked. And it's going to be personal and different for each individual. But you've been living more in your spirit... Maybe the rock is going to be less of a blow. Maybe, or maybe your world is going to be rock, but in a good, positive way. Today I had two really cool offers, man. I woke up and one guy offered me his home, a, a place to live in Indiana. <laughs> it's too far and I can't do, I can't do the Midwest winters. I think, I, I, I mean, but I'm just like, man, see, that's the heart. I mean, people can do that stuff. They just don't want to because they're always told you can't do stuff like that. Well, that's stupid or that's not... 
that's not economically sound or minded or, well, that's not going to do anything for our third quarter profits at all if you do something from your heart and burr, 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 all that shit. <sighs> then another another woman, um, she, she's, she, she's, she uses her powers and she's like guessed the lottery numbers before accurately, but didn't play them. Just guessed them and she was right. According to her, she's right. She said she, if she ever won big, that she'd give me a million dollars. And I'm like, you know what? That's the thing. Someone gives me a million dollars, Monarch Butterfly. I'll give 40, I'll keep 49% and then give half 51%. I'll pay that forward to somebody else like me that has a vision and ideas, you know, that I can endorse and support their, their, their vision too because I see how they see and you know when these connections are made in these divine unions are made and these ideas are cultivated from places of love the world is going to freaking evolve into a much better place and the way I look at it right now is is this eclipse I'm just gonna I'm just it's my time to go within that's what my line minutes are my planetary alignments are it's just plan plan for the next stage don't spend money save your money you know, just try not to rock the boat in too many areas of your lives and, 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 you know, don't blow up your life like you've always done it before. And that's what I'm trying to do now is not blow up my life because I'm scared. Because I don't know how things are going to turn out, but there's so many times that I didn't know how things were going to turn out. They turned out just fine. And I know a lot of times that when I feel these fears, these fears aren't mine. So I keep, I keep looking at you know, at the end of that scene in, in Raiders of the Lost Ark, when he's like, just don't look. Don't look. See, everybody's looking at the shiny stuff right now. Everybody's chasing sensations. Everybody's going for that gazillion, bazillion dollars or that control. Everybody's going for that gold ring. And I'm over here just like, don't look. Don't wor look. Don't look until the dust settles. Because now is the time for the ego to show people. I mean, 2020 is a year of clear vision. People are supposed to reveal themselves for who they are, good and for better or worse. I ain't here to judge nobody on what their for better or worse was. I lived every incarnation. I've been the, I've been the freaking sinner. I've been the saint. And you know, we are all aspects of, of all of these things. We are all all of these things. And so for me to deem someone as a, you know, all I, what I do is I just say, deem people as low vibrational beings or high vibrational beings. I'm really trying to stay in that mind space. Oh, that's a no viber. <sighs> you know, Pisces, Virgo, rising is a very good sign. <sighs> I just heard that in my ear right now. So don't look right now. Just go within and look at you and your own stuff and where your ego has impeded your progress and where your behavior has, has kept you stuck. And where your own where, where you got had to get so big and then you couldn't get out of your own way and then you stopped your life from progressing. That's what I'm looking at right now. That's what I'm doing. Going I'm going in deep in my own self reflection of all all my, my, my wounded masculine and feminine this is like the last ditch purge, you know, because now it's like you can't, if you haven't absolved these, the wreckage of your past by now, you know, that's just ego stuff. When you're living in the past, that's all ego. When you're living in the future, that's ego. Present is where spirit's found. <laughs> cat's just right there. I'm like, where's the cat? <laughs> He's just chilling over here. Ah, it's a beautiful day. I know a lot of people are hurting right now. A lot of people just don't even know. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I could be wrong about all this. We could just be living in a 3D earth, you know? And I'm just a contrarian. Just going against the grain. Just to, you know, be a clown. You know? Maybe, maybe... Um... Maybe things are as serious as they say, but the thing of it is, is my whole life, if they've been saying serious things, that the world is in a serious kind of ways, and then, you know, I found out after the fact that it's all pageantry. 
because they just want people to be scared because the bottom line my mom even she it's all to perpetuate fear march it's all to make money money you know it's all to it's all to generate money it's all because when people are scared they spend more you know and it and everyone knows it's an election year and so you know it's more bullshit it's just bullshit you know however they they, they 131 million raised in campaign funds that's a slap in the face that's that's disgusting that's that's a reindeer game there's no spirit in any of that that's just all swing and wieners that's just all swing and wiener shit that's just all look at me and back in my glory day I used to be, do this but now you old and you freaking decrepit and you need to freaking sit down and let the next generation take over because you done fuck too much shit up boomers you done it with your ideology and your patriarchal bullshit and your freaking misogynistic swinging wiener shit sit down boomer Go suck on your Viagra and tell your wife you love her and maybe she'll forgive you for all this shit you've done. <laughs> yeah. Hey, and you know what the funny part is? Is all this, that twisted, low vibrational, all that stuff that I just talked about, it's in women too. It's in that woman that got arrested today, Epstein's girlfriend. She's just, she's the worst of the worst because she's a woman and so in her ego, so in her masculine energy that she turned on her own sex and gender and turned young women over like the ultimate predator. And these are the people, these are the people I read their energy. See, cause it ain't all love and light. It ain't all love and light, you know? And so unless you've done the work, Unless you've done the work, unless you have gone through the measure to do the spiritual work right now, to go within and look at all your character defects and go back and say, you know what, I was really a jerk to this person. I should probably acknowledge that, you know, and clean up some of this shit that you've done. And then not only just doing that, but not acting the same way every day that caused you to have to make that amend or apology or whatever, you know, all that stuff. Where's the accountability? That's what I'm waiting for. The accountability. People that, you know, I was wrong, I did this. Cause I, I did it, I done it. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to clean it all up right now. I got, got, got one I gotta do and then, you know, I'm good, you know? Until I do something that I step out in my ego and then I, I cause myself to, to act the way I used to act again, you know? People have to be accountable, they gotta be. They got to be, I mean, where's the, you, people don't get to win all the time of living in ego, ego. They don't. They don't. From shitting on people and freaking making people feel bad about themselves. Year after year after year after year and just going around doing it. People don't get to win all the time like that. They don't. God, these little aphid things, man. I hate them. They're, they're like little crabs. <laughs> they're like little cancers. Freaking hate them. It's one of the reasons why I don't like to be outside freaking so much because bugs are always on me and the mosquitoes are the worst. Anyway, so um, as the cycle, it's like I look at the cycle as almost like a drain spinning down, you know, like a drain, like like how time goes in a cycle, circle, circular. I look, that's, you know, it's like the it's like people, are, all right. You know, stop living in ego. Stop living in ego. And and people are like, yeah, you know, maybe I should live healthier. Maybe I should do this. And, you know, every year, you know, when they're, they have their, their you know, the, the planets align and, and, and Thanksgiving comes around. They have all these things to be grateful for. But still they're like about 10 pounds heavier than they were last year. And, and they just keep doing the same thing over and over. Like literally people live the same years over and over until they die. Like, some people, you can set your clock to it. The idea of living the same day over and over to me is just mind-numbing. That's why I was so mad all the time, putting myself into a structure. Spirits are supposed to be free. <laughs> you know, like, you're supposed to wake up with the sun and things like that, naturally. And people have created this whole control paradigm of just do as I say, because don't you know who I am? And it's just weird. 
people just bought into it, hook, line, and sinker. I didn't. I went, I played along because I just kept getting, because every time I don't play along, I get in trouble. Every time I call something out for bullshit, you know, that's when the powers that be like to come in and just establish their authority. And I'm just like, whatever. <laughs> whatever dude my glory days are over you know i know my glory days are over so if my glory days are over sorry for all you you know born in 74 and after you know you still got something to prove you ain't proved it now you ain't gonna <laughs> it's just about being a good person at this point just caring more about your community people around you and not saying, you know, and not buying yourself a freaking $120,000 car and driving around going, toot toot, I care about everyone, toot toot, I love everyone, toot toot, Every, whatever color this week that lives matter, then so be it, toot toot, you know, you know? <laughs> it's just like, whatever is the latest and greatest, toot toot. I remember when I, I was, I think, yeah, I was either just about to be out of the Air Force in 2005. Two, whenever Jackass 2 came out and the nation made it the number one movie and the, you know, the number one movie in the nation was Jackass 2. I'm like, fucking stupid motherfuckers. You know, and I hung out with the people and I always left. Before, Let's get the gallon of milk and make yourself throw up because you're a freaking moron. You know, and then every energy and patterns go in cycles, you know, and, and, and that's why trends go back around and come back around. And now we're going back into the love trend and people got to remember with the love and the sex and the lust comes karma too, you know. So all that shit that people used to be able to do to freaking, you know, <laughs> rock it off into the next freaking vibrational frequency, whether it's bone in or freaking you know, drinking or eating, uh, drugs, whatever gets your vibe torqued, you know, whatever you got to do to get yourself go. I, I, I just assume meditate, <laughs> you know, you, you don't even need to chase sensations when you feel the rapture of meditation in the Kundalini awakening. Psh, that's how I know that I, uh, I'm kind of better off for, you know, cause I don't even, I, I'm like, so much of my angst was just because I couldn't find someone that was nice to me and liked me and that was pretty and that, you know, I couldn't find a par partner and I couldn't find all this shit. And I'm just like, dude, ain't nobody could find me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm killing bugs all over my laptop. It's so stupid. I hate it. Anyway, little reminders. Get off my stuff. <laughs> There's a lot of that cantankerous energy in the world, too. Anyway. Hi, Ahmad. Ahmad, Ahmad. Go watch some, and that, that Airbender show that you recommended. I watched about 20 minutes. I'm just, like, kind of scatterbrained right now. I'm all over the place, you know, the in, just cancer in my first, second house. My rising... It's, everything's all fluid and you just kind of got to allow for stuff, you know, and, and, uh, I guess the, another, like, main theme is travel isn't a good idea right now. Long distance travel isn't a good idea. If you do travel, you know, be sure to plan to go someplace that you might want to be for a while. <laughs> Inadvertently or not, you know, so the world is... It's going to be okay. Things are going to settle down eventually. Well, things are, are good, can settle down immediately as long as you settle yourself down. That's the thing is it doesn't matter what happens in the external world as, as long as people learn to calm themselves down and whatever they face in light, they're going to see, they're going to, they're going to see they can handle, you know, that, that they're not going to shrivel up and die. You, you know, there, there's not ever been a time in history, I don't know, I don't know, I'd have to really think about that, but mental health right now, for people, they just don't understand energy, and if they just, you know, if they just got on the path of self-awareness of astrology and energy and whole, you know, just balance, it, things would be so much less scary for them. 
but that takes effort and, and, and discipline, you know. It takes discipline to study and to listen to people that you don't necessarily like all the time, but they have good information, you know. Learning isn't always just great for me. A lot of it's just, like, the same information, but then I'm getting bits and, you know, I just put it together how I know how I see. It's a pretty bird, though. Don't eat the pretty bird. So... Just, you know, stay in touch with people if you're having a hard time. So far, I'm, I'm doing okay. You know, I've been spending time outside. This is the third time that freaking, I got a picture of an old uh, hummingbird. I wonder if it's the same one that's right there that came by earlier. I put it up on, did I put a picture of that on Insta? I don't remember. <laughs> it's all a blur. I, got, I put a crow up on, on Snapnax and a finch that had that was down by the creek and it, it was like it's like one of those hidden picture ones like you gotta look and this finch oh boy had freaking his hands full and his mouth full of stuff he was he's like gathering for nest stuff you know so um so yeah i think just to recap that was the big takeaways today is that you know this so this eclipse energy is gonna be for the egos to be like out of my way i want to see like the 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 the, the the like the the bratty girls and the and the and the little bratty boys me first me first don't you know who i am all those that grow up to you know be politicians now is let them look but don't look if you're the light don't look at this one sit this one out it's about all i got for now hope you have a rad day peace